President Trump traveling to Dover Air Force Base yesterday to honor the return of four Americans killed in an ISIS attack in Syria this week. One of those service members is Chief Petty Officer Shannon Kent, who leaves behind a husband and two young children. Well, the Tunnel to Towers Foundation, which does such great work, you've seen them on Fox and Friends, they help pay off mortgages for families of fallen heroes of all kinds. This morning, the organization is planning to help the Kent family in a big way. And joining us now is the CEO of the Tunnel to Towers Foundation, Frank Siller. Frank, great to have you back, unfortunately, under these difficult yes, circumstances. But, of course, we all know you lost one of your brothers, a New York City firefighter, on 9-11. And this family, the Kent family, has ties, uh, firefighters in the family, and uh, it really hits personally to you. Uh, it does. Uh, her uncle uh, actually called me up the, the night uh, this happened and when he found out he's a retired New York City firefighter, Vinnie Plover, a longtime friend. I went to high school with him. The Plovers, her, uh, so the chief uh, petty officer, Kent, uh, his mother grew up on Staten Island. We're a Staten Island family. Uh, so we, know, we knew the Plovers for over 60 years, as a matter of fact. Mm -hmm. So uh, Vinny called up uh, and told me what had happened to his niece, Shannon. Uh, I remember when she joined the service because he called me then, too. He said, Frank, Aww. my niece is joining, uh, mm -hmm. you know, the Navy. You know, she wants to go out because what happened on 9-11. And he was so proud of that fact. Uh, so he was. She uh, wanted to serve our country. She wanted to serve our country. It's uh, very, very sad. Now that whole family, <laughs> it knows about serving. Vinny was a, a, a firefighter. His father, so her grandfather, was a New York City cop. Mm. Uh, the father, Shannon's father, is a uh, New York cop, one of the highest rank in New York State uh, police officers. Mm. Brothers, a Marine, and a husband uh, served this country too. And they leave behind two beautiful, uh, uh, two beautiful boys. Now, mm. your organization, Tunnel to Towers, has done such transformative work for people's lives. So amazing. How, how do you hope to help this family? Well, listen, we want to take the pressure of a mortgage off this family. We know they just finished a, a house, their forever home. Uh, you, mm. you know, making plans. You know. Mm. It's incredible how life changes mm. in a moment. Uh, so we're asking everyone to go to tunneltotowers.org. Join us on this. Does just like we just did for the Singh family mm -hmm. uh, out in California. Out in California, the police officer out there that we raised the money, and paid off the mortgage. So we're starting this today. Go to tunneltotowers.org. You can make a, 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 a donation uh, to uh, Shannon Kent's uh, family and her two boys left behind a husband. Now. Uh, also, you could join us on $11 a month mission that we, yep. we're, we're asking everyone, all Americans out there, come on, get off the yep. couch, go out there yep. and, and sign up for this $11 a month because we could, there's so many. There was Absolutely. Uh, there was like 50 service members that yeah. died mm. uh, last year and how many police officers and firefighters. Frank, thank you so much thank for everything you, Frank, that you do. Thank you, Frank. We remember uh, Shannon Kent, but also all four Correct. that lost their lives. Mm.